Hey guys, this is Edward with the iPhone 911 here. We got ourselves uh, iPhone 4S this morning. Um, we're gonna do some taking apart. Alright, this is a Verizon version. All that seems the same. Or Verizon. What I mean is it was ordered for Verizon. You can see the Verizon SIM card on there. Okay, that's the welcome screen. Don't really need that. We are gonna be, we are interested in the insides, not the outsides. Oh, uh huh. Screws are the same as the AT&T current iPhone 4. And we are going to be comparing it to the previous models of the iPhones to see what's different, what's okay. the same. And, all right, this is the book. All right, and this should be done. Line should be done within within the hour, and there's still going to be okay. some updates. So I would say maybe an hour and a half. So if you want, you can come by there today. From what it normal. seems like. It's more based on the right. Verizon, on the current Verizon Ten iPhone, six. but it does have differences from right. either, I can see that. All right, bye -bye. This is the first iPhone that I'm taking apart, so... I don't think the line will run. You don't think so? Of course, do On the on the S um, SSD? No, the eighty gig Apple one. It says uh, see a lot of Verizon similarities here, a lot of it. All these little screws, all this is the Verizon one. Alright, where did that go? Ah, oh, there we go. It's a charger port. Okay. Same connectors, the motherboard, all this seems like it's the Verizon copy. The connectors seem the same. Now this right here is something different, slightly. The placement of the placement of some of the what are they called? Screws. Bottom. This right here is the same as the Verizon bottom charging port. Mark, can you get me a Verizon back? And the front too. I forgot about that. Another Verizon thing. Right here's the difference. 
I know they have a screw in there. I remember this from the Horizon one. There we go. Right into it. And now the motherboard comes out. It's covered by a little cloth. Not a cloth, but a piece of tape, I guess. So we've got the motherboard out. Very similar to the Verizon one. Corners except the fourth one. There it is, covered by a piece of tape as always. And let me just give this a little heat. I see it the home button is a difference the home button is now part of the LCD just like the iPod touch fourth generation design um, the proximity sensor I did see the part it was different yes yeah the new home button redesigned um, Let's compare some parts. Here's the Verizon ski. Oh, here we go. This is the screen off of Verizon one. And if we compare it, those three are the same. The corners are all the same. Different on the right this or left side this these two connectors are different so the Verizon the, the current iPhone 4s is different from both the AT&T iPhone 4 or the Verizon iPhone 4 all right let's put it back Ten four, it says you cannot open this, open this, whatever. So let's install this, no ever. No. This work on it? Well, which one does it on right now? Ten four. Hey. Four and ten six. Let's see if it works. Hey, Mark. Stop. It. Can't lose the info. Though.
four corners. Let's put in the motherboard. Actually, vibrator. So I got the vibrator. Now we're putting in the motherboard. kind of made our own little screwdriver for these screws the huge thick ones make sure not to bend the pins the wrong way that will cause you some uh, Wi-Fi problems service problems If you can check what firmware it's on, if it's on 422, it could it could be done. But we would have to restore it for it to work. Yeah, if it's on the 4.2.2 firmware. Few more scores left. Uh, I think there's a few apps, like cool apps yeah. you can get from City on there too. But um, I don't know. I haven't. I haven't really seen one myself. But I mean, we do have a we have a old TV set up over here. We can see what's cool about it, what's so good about it. We can figure it out. Huh? Okay. 
Oh, same as always in 15. Alright, sounds good. Alright, mm -hmm, bye bye. <laughs> did you broke an apple tea? I did. You did? Pretty cool. Was yeah. it season pass? Uh -uh. Oh, it's no reason to wear Custom firmware? Yeah, I think so. Well, I'm just looking at this program called. Um. And there you guys have it. <laughs> Complicated level, I would say harder than both the AT&T or Verizon Force. Just because they added a few little, oh, let's see the back comparisons. Okay, that side the same. If I take this is off the CDMA iPhone, we put it on. Snaps on. And goes all the way in so that's off a CDMA one right now and this is obviously the original one There you have it, guys. Thank you from the iPhone 901. Have a great one.